Beginning tomorrow, drivers are going to have to pay a higher fine if they're caught passing a stopped school bus. State law requires all vehicles to stop when a school bus driver activates the flashing lights and the crossing arm is extended. On August 1st, violators will be fined $500. That's up from $300. Here's Angela Davis with more. It's one of the first things we learn as drivers. Always stop when you're behind or facing a school bus that's picking up or dropping off students. But in the last six years, police officers across Minnesota have written nearly 9,000 tickets for stop arm violations. I think part of the time is people are always in a rush. Our people are in a hurry. They don't want to get stuck behind a bus because they know that the bus will stop. Peter Bachhuber is a bus driver for St. Paul Public Schools. I think a lot of it is distracted driving too, whether it's just talking on the phone or if it's a lot of times we'll see texting because we're up higher so we can see down into other people's vehicles. He's seen his share of drivers breaking the law. We see people, they just don't pay attention. The bus has red flashing lights and everyone knows red means stop. And you know, we're, you know, we're dealing with children. We're dealing with, you know, people's babies. Last fall in Otsego, three students were seriously injured at their bus stop when they were hit by the driver of a pickup truck. The state patrol hopes the $500 fine will serve as a deterrent to drivers. We want to encourage people to pay, pay attention to what's happening around them. And the $500 fine, that's a pretty expensive cost for most people. Angela Davis, WCCO 4 News. The state patrol says a survey of 3,600 bus drivers this year shows 703 reported stop arm violations in just one day.